Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So, just a quick video today, one little unboxing or unbagging. Uh, yeah, and you'll probably guess what it is as soon as you see it. Uh, yeah, it's the one then. Um, when I did the last unboxing of these, then I did mention one and say I didn't know what happened to it. Well, it's arrived, so yay! It's here, it's here. Um, and I just thought I'd give you a little bit of a catch up on what we've been up to. So, yeah, I've not had uh, many videos in the last week because I've had uh, my friend come to stay and then my brother's been for a visit from London um, with his family. So, yeah, it's been busy, busy, busy and we've been out for a few days as well because the weather's been great. Uh, but, yeah, we are raining again today. So I've got the light on and I've got shadows and I must get my new lights set up, but I've not had a chance to because I've just not been in my craft room and I've not done any diamond painting for seven days. Oh, shock horror. Da, da, da. but yeah i've got lots to get back to so i've got a lot of catching up to do right so let's have a look in here and see what we've got look it's one of those funny little stands again oh my goodness me at least it's arrived in time for me to get it done right so let's get into this and have a look i hope everybody is doing okay and life is treating you as well as possible uh yeah i know there's been all sorts of things going on around the world at the moment but uh, fingers crossed everybody is doing okay right so we have lots and lots of crystals we have a pen boat and wax standard little toolkit so these are all crystals we've got the piece of uh, rubbish in the packet thank you very much oh we've got a hot pink yeah but look at these, we have a one, <laughs> two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, <laughs> nine, ten little gonks all dressed up for Halloween. These are fabulous. These I actually saw before I saw the um, Christmas ones. I'd seen these and I thought, oh, I've got to get those. They will definitely be used as decorations. They're not going to be used as coasters. I just couldn't put a cup on top of one of these. I think they're absolutely wonderful. Uh, and they were from AliExpress. I'll put the details in the comments down below. You do need to click on the more button next to the description. And then if you click on more again, you get all the full description and all my details and all my discounts and everything that I get from everybody. So if you want to do that and have a look, but aren't these just absolutely fabulous? Oh, I love them. So where to start? I think I only paid about seven or eight pound for these as well i know they were a really really good price um i'll do a quick measure of one i think they're going to be standard size because we have just got our standard little stand to put them in look no cock backings or anything you can always put one on yourself if you do want to use them as coasters but as i say i'm probably going to put a peg um or something on the back of them or even a magnet and put them um on the back on the fridge or something but uh, yeah i can't imagine using them as coasters they're all just too cute that one is just really making me laugh that is just so funny right so we have uh 10 centimeters four and a quarter ish inches by about three and a half inches nine centimeters so yeah i'm not going to measure them all because they're all going to be more or less the same but aren't these just fabulous what a great little set of characters whoever's thought these up they're just marvelous and as i say i just i know i always say it and i am sorry for repeating myself but I just can't believe how much character you can get from something that just literally is a nose and a beard and a moustache. <laughs> so we have, let's start off with our witch's hat with our potion and our witch's broom. Oh, we've even got like a little cut out there, look. That's brilliant. These have been really well laser cut. They are the wooden ones. Um there's one layer of wood in the middle with like a, a veneer style thing put over the top. Uh, you just take your cover sheet off the front as normal as any diamond painting and you've got your sticky underneath and all your numbers to tell you where all your different gems go. 
all your crystals but yeah he's fabulous he looks quite a wise one doesn't he because he, he's got his potion and he's an orange potion so i wonder if it's got pumpkin in it but uh, yeah and he's got a very big broom look at the curve on that broom wow i wonder if he goes riding it excellent okay and oh look at this one we have a very crumpled hat and it looks like we've got some like Frankenstein bolts on the side of his hat. Now, whether he stuck them to his head um, and they've come through his hat, I'm not quite sure. He's got his uh, little pumpkin, a very smiley pumpkin, little basket look to put all his trick or treat stuff in. And he's got like a lollipop that's an eyeball. Wow. Okay. Oh, look, and you can see the little pink rosy cheeks on this one. So he's obviously been out trick or treating because he's got pink rosy cheeks because it'll be a little bit chilly out there. And again, we've just got that little bit of cut out. Just that extra detail makes them just that little bit more, a little bit better. I just think that a little bit more detailed, as I say, just, uh, yeah, I like that. But he's really funny. Okay. I like the way they're all stood with the feet like that as well. Ooh, this one's there. Uh, Ooh, mystical look. I think this is uh, the adult party. Now then, he's got a cloak on look with a big collar, a big red collar at the back. And he's holding a glass of wine. So, yeah, he's gone to an adult party, hasn't he? And he's dressed up as like the Grand Wizard or something with a skull on his hat. And uh, his big cloak on. Wah, wah, wah. <laughs> oh, that one just really makes me laugh, though. He just looks so crumpled. <laughs> <laughs> and then we've got this one with a nice witch's hat again and this one's got the witch's cauldron oh look and he just put an eyeball into the cauldron there and we've got a skull on the cauldron Ooh, and it's just spilling out over the edge whatever is mixing there what is it eye of newton wing of bat or tail of bat or something like that and uh, yeah so there you are that's your little witchy one and what's this one then? Oh, this is the mummy. <laughs> I think he's been out trick-or-treating a while though because all his bandages are starting to come off him, look. So he's carrying a pumpkin that looks quite a bit shocked, which to be fair, if somebody's um, mummy outfit started unravelling, I hope he's got something on underneath. <laughs> then, uh, yeah, I'd probably look a bit shocked as well. And he's carrying a spider. Oh my goodness, and the spider's even got little eyes on it. Oh, that's excellent. I like that one. That's really, really funny. So, and he's got a little pink cheek as well. So, yeah, he's been out trick-or-treating. So, I think we've got the adults here, look, with the potions. And uh, we've got the kids here, look, with the little pink cheeks that have been out trick-or-treating. So, which one are you? Oh, he's dressed up as uh, the devil. Look. He's got his little fork, look, with the prongs on it. And, uh, oh, he's even got a little devil tail, look, there as well. So, yeah, I think that one's uh, adult party as well with the, uh, this is probably alcohol in these. They've made them look like potions, but I think they're probably alcohol. And I do think, looking at these gems, that these could possibly be skulls or something that are on the front of these. Yeah, that one's got one as well. So I think these are, uh, are probably skulls. So it looks like it's uh, a potion. Ooh. So let's put the kids down here and we'll keep the adults up there. I could be completely wrong. I'm just making up stories as I go along. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh, no, that, that one's trick-or-treating. All right. So, so far we have a four adults and a three kids. So I've just got these three to look at. So let's look at this one. Oh, this is one. Oh, he's, oh, he's another mummy. Oh, my goodness. Do you think these are twins then? So these are twins. Yeah. Ooh, and he's got uh, he's got a potion there, look. Ooh. Why was he holding that then? Do you think somebody's thrown that at him? He's got his pink cheeks the same. This one's only got one pink cheek, but he's been dressed up as a mummy. Uh, looks like he's got... Ooh, I don't know what that is. I think that might be a beetle that's set uh, in his wrappings there. He's got a spider the same. Oh, he's smart. Oh, look, this one's going to be saying, my spider and pumpkin are bigger than yours. So he's going to say, well, I've got a bottle as well. <laughs> so that causes a lot of arguments if they don't get the same, even if they're not twins. <laughs> so that's those two then, dressed up as unravelling mummies. 
So what have we got here? And I just love this one. This one just really made me smile. He's got a ghost hat on look with the little eyes and the mouth. But he's got the pink cheeks as well. And he's got a really, that's an enormous sweet. God, imagine having a sweet that's as big as your hand. That's fantastic. Oh, if that was chocolate, I'd have a really good go at that. <laughs> and he's got his little pumpkin as well, his little basket for collecting things in. Oh, that's brilliant. I love that one. And then what's this one then? Oh, and then he's got, oh, that looks really evil. That one's got a wah, wah, wah face on it. And what's he carrying then? That looks like bunting. Oh, it says boo on it. Oh, right, he's carrying a bunting to say boo. So maybe he's lost his voice. So instead of saying trick or treat, he's just getting people to open the door and he holds his sign up saying boo. <laughs> oh, that's excellent. And he's got little red cheeks. Oh, wow. I, I, I love these. I absolutely love these. Aren't they just fabulous? So we've got two sort of devilly type ones, two sort of witchy ones with cauldrons and brooms, two ghosty ones. Um, these look like... Well, actually, they're sort of twinny as well, aren't they? But he's got an eyeball lolly and he's got, um, well, he's got a potion as well. And then these two, so oh, aren't they just wonderful? I'm just so glad I got these. They're just marvellous. Can't wait to get them done. So let me have a look at these crystals. Just get rid of the rubbish out of the packet. Thank you very much. Seem to have started getting a lot of those again at the moment. Right, so how many different ones do we have? Goodness me, these are lovely and sparkly. So 16, 17 different colours. Wow, so we're starting off with a lovely cherry red and a honey gold colour. And is that two bags of silver? Yep, that's your standard silver crystal. Look at the sparkle on those, excellent. Then we've got like a grey, blacky colour. I don't know whether that is black or not. It doesn't look quite black. It looks more grey. And then a pale gold. And, ooh, look at that blue. That's a bit different. What's that sort of a denim -y blue? And a very bright green. And a very deep red. <laughs> and a lovely bright orange. And a grass green. And we've got a hot pink. Yay, I'm calling hot pink. And a very deep purple. And another darker gold. And a bronzy colour. And then, oh, that's a different one as well. That's sort of a greeny bronzy colour. And then a lemony colour. And then another pale green at the end. Excellent. Okay, so I really am loving all the coasters and everything that's coming out at the moment and all the new things that are coming out. I mean, actually, you could split these into two sets, couldn't you? Because you've got two of those, two of those, two of those, two of those, and then just one each of those. Yeah, so you could give these to people if you wanted to do them as coasters, two sets of five, and they're sort of like getting one each, uh, slightly different. So, yeah, oh, just, they're absolutely hysterical. Which one's your favourite? Um, I did think that this one was, no, yeah, this one was my favourite with the ghost on his head. Um, but I think I'm liking Mr. Crumpled over here with his little eyeball lolly. <laughs> a big eyeball lolly. <laughs> okay. Well, as I say, um, the past few days have been really busy. We've been out and had a look around uh, one of the garden centres that was just on the verge of opening uh, up it's Christmas place. I've done a little bit of filming of the Christmas. Um, we stopped and had some dinner in there as well. And Millie stopped with us and I had a little bit. And then we've been out to Mr Moo's again, our lovely ice cream parlour. And they've started doing doggy ice cream. So Millie got an ice cream. So I'll put a little bit of footage of that as well at the end of this video. So it's a little bit of a mixed, a little bit of a catch up. Uh, I am still here. Um, and then tomorrow's video will be another, another epic video sealing all my special drill projects, uh, canvases and uh, notebooks and bags and various other bits and pieces and the little figures and things that I've done as well. So, um, and a few more questions answered on sealing and an update on those coasters that I did in the last video. So, yeah, quite a bit to do. 
Okay, well, I hope you've enjoyed looking at these with me. I think they're fabulous. I can't wait to get on with them. Uh, if you have enjoyed it, a thumbs up is always very much appreciated. Any comments or questions in the comments down below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. And I am catching up on my comments. I have got a lot still to do. So I'm sorry if I've not replied to you, but I will get there. And if you want to join our family and see what we get up to next, then if you press that subscribe button down in this corner and the all notifications bell that pops up, you'll be notified when any of my videos come up. So you're not going to miss anything. Yay. Okay. Thanks ever so much for stopping by. And I do hope to see you all again soon. Bye for now. You having a snack stop? Lily. Uh, Lily, come on. Never stay, never stay. Okay. Can you do that? Was that nice? Was that nice? Did you have some nice milk? And, um, it went. You've got well, milk all over your face. Right. Yeah. Oh, wait. Wash, right. wash your chops. Wash like your chops. This.
Is that nice dog ice cream? Hey. Yeah. Oh, she's eating it, yeah. Oh, look, I'm absolutely. Hey, you having this? Millie? Oh, you like that, didn't you? Is that nice? Come on then. 